I was planning to make a simple vlog about a day in the life of a PhD student. But my head can't get away with ideas I'm bringing now about the challenging experience of a PhD life. I could romanticize life as a researcher, but I didn't expect the doctorate to be what it is now. So instead, I'd rather bring you the harsh truth. Right now, I'm planning to write as much as I can of my thesis, as I'm going to submit it to the qualification exam in less than two months from now on. This is a mandatory step here in Brazil, to write the first version of the research with a literature review, preliminary results, and expected research timeline. Then, do a presentation to an examining committee, which evaluates the feasibility of the research and suggests improvements. It has been exactly 16 months since I started my doctorate in civil engineering. I'm back in my college field after doing a master's in radiation materials and mineral. Though I focused on material science and started studying the same material, I'm researching for applications in construction for my PhD. Until this, I have overcome challenges I would never have imagined. The first year of the PhD has been full of new experience and life lessons. And honestly, I'm grateful for it. But at the same time, I can't lie, it also has been an overwhelming thing to deal with. A roller coaster of emotions and a constant rush. That's the harsh truth about pursuing a PhD. I knew it was hard, but not at this level. Now, I'm more adapted to the difficulty level, as it is not a surprise for me anymore. But I wish I had known this sooner, so I could have prepared better for it. If you plan to get into grad school, I advise you to choose a field of study you really enjoy, or it will be much harder to deal with. Also, Take advantage of this time to improve important skills for your career and life, as this might be a great opportunity to bring you a lot of life development. So this is my first video documenting my life as a PhD student, and I'd like to know if you enjoy this content format. Like this video and leave your comments to let me know. I have a lot of new ideas and experiences to share, so don't forget to subscribe so you can see my next video. Thank you.